I know what you're saying. Hey, brother, that's a spiffy jacket you got on there. Yeah, you're right. I got this from, uh, it, it, but it's, it's, it's a little bit down, it's somewhere between King and uh, you know, King Williamstown and uh, East London. There's a, a, a near Denzana, the, the township, there's a, there's a, um, a, a factory outlet kind of thing. Actually, it's not a factory outlet. It used to be something else, like selling linen and stuff like that, but then they changed. It's like a, they call it a German shop, a German clothing shop, or something like that. But it really is one of those vintage shops. You know, vintage is like a, a secondhand store. They don't have much of that in South Africa, but this is like a huge one. And I was there like earlier uh, uh, this month. Yeah, earlier this month. I got this nice jacket over there. So I got to wear it today because I'm doing something. But you know, I got a little quandary because this is one of the vests I like. My wife made it for me. It's really nice, but it doesn't go with everything. So I got to sort of change. I got to take, take the vest off, leave my Swazi shirt on. And then put the jacket on because it goes with it, you know, like that. Ah, yeah. Put my jacket on like that. Get a shirt like that. One of those golf shirts like that. That looks better like that. I can't believe really it's a vest, which I really like. Anyway, so it's, I got the spiffy, you know, jacket and I'm wearing my fake Pradas because I got to go see the cat that plans, you know, um, uh, well, make an appointment. Something like that. I got to go see this cat on the University of. Uh, of Fort Harris campus that has the planning for all the buildings because I have an initiative. You know, see, see, I got this jacket, of course. Uh, in fact, I got this idea for this jacket, with this place, I'm going to take a bunch of students there, and like they're getting a next semester to shop, you know, because it's like really, really cheap clothing. Anyway, I think they even have a scheme. I think, and I say a German song, I think they get all that stuff from, from Europe, right? And there's some sort of scam that they send it down here and then they sell it down here, you know? Uh, I don't know. I could be wrong. I, I've been wrong before, but the reason I got to see this guy because I have this thing. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm putting in for a, a water one of these uh, buildings. Anyway, look, I just want I want a residency for for uh, international students, like a quiet, you know, something that we control, not this chaos that happens there when all the stuff that the criminality, what's the stuff. Usually, most, most international students, you know, at least ones on our camps are postgraduates. So I need a I need a, a residency for them. So in this residency, though, I got this idea. To get into the residency, note this. You have to write a 1,500-word a essay. Yep. It's a, word, it's a word essay on a non-European scholar, movement leader, political figure, or person of historical note. You have to write this essay to get into this, into this house, into this complex, right? And then also, you have to write an additional 500-word missive which would, which would um, be requested from their home uh, or community attesting to the person's maturity. Think about that. An additional 500 word missive would be requested from their home community. You know, they have this thing, they come from their home community. And at least, now, here's the thing. The, the student themselves could write it, but it has to be witnessed by at least two members of that community, a teacher, a preacher, a parent, guardian, clan chief, politician, business person, something like, something like that. Think about that. That's to get into the residency. Now, once you have that, you have a secure place in that residency until you showed up. That means you can show up the last moment, you know what I mean? Because you're a thing. Now, of course, you don't show up. Then, well, you know, or you don't say you're not going to show up. Now, but here's the thing about this residency. They have different rooms and stuff like that, but it would be named after certain certain people, like 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 Kwame Nkrumah, you know, C.L.R. James, Franz Fanon, you know, like 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 Queen Nana, you know, like 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 uh, uh, Formalio uh, uh, Kuti, you know, this fellow, uh, uh, fellow, uh, uh, I, I cannot put Kuti is, you know, her mother. You know, people of note, you know. They would, they would, they, the rooms would be named after. They have common areas, like with, with the Kingdom of Congo area, you know what I mean, or the um, the 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 the, uh, the Nguni tribe, you know. That's what the Nguni tribe. That's where all the the, the Interbelli and the Swazis and the Tosas and the Zulus come out of that 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 thing. Even though they make like they're separate, but they're all the same, like that. But they have areas like like the Pan African Women's Organization area. Let me record it. Maybe I even had this thing where I didn't put it here, but it'd be like. The, 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 you know, uh, uh, but anyway, it's the stuff, it's stuff, you know, OAU, the you know, area, like, like that, there's areas and, and rooms. Now, in each room, each room, 
you'd have a rendition of the of, of the person, like, like, like say somebody like Walter Rodney. You know, you have his his, his, his the, I would work with the arts, with the uh, fine arts department. They make the image like that, and then we have writing on there about that. So each area would would be historic, just like the University of Fort Harris historic. Uh, just an idea. I'm going to run this past a bunch of people, and you know, even if it doesn't fly, it doesn't matter to me. You come up with ideas that don't work now, eh? Future is still at hand. That's what I say. That, that I'm being me, T from the Patterson State Trains to bed, letting you know what I only suspect.